Hello guys, thanks for watching, Adrian here from Epsid. So in this um, short video I will um, demonstrate how to download uh, on, a, on my local file system uh, Django Data Able uh, Starter which is open source and uh, saved on GitHub. Once, uh, once I have the source code I will uh, open the project using VS Code and just follow up the instructions as provided on the, um, on the readme file. So uh, let's go click here on the download, uh, download button once we we are redirected to to github we need to copy this address uh, go back to to our file system and uh, simply download the project using uh, JIT clone in case uh, you are not familiar with JIT and uh, JIT commands uh, feel free to use the zip and uh, download the zip from here is the same thing and uh, unzip the archive on your file system and uh, follow up the the instructions as provided by the readme file so i will uh, open up the project visualize the, um, the readme and uh, there are several sections here that uh, explain how to start the application using docker but this will be demonstrate uh, will be this demonstration will uh, will be done in another video and uh, for now we need to go to the manual build section and uh, follow up the instructions here so as uh, as the readme specifies we need to first to create a virtual environment activate the virtual environment install all the modules Once all the um, dependencies are installed, we need to migrate the database. Okay, other things we can do from, from this point is to create a super user. which is basically the admin account of, uh, of our application and um, for newcomers this uh, super account is um, can manage all the all the assets of our of our project like um, registered users and all other applications that are registered to be visible in the um, for the super user account Okay, now we can run the server and uh, simply access the, the application in the browser. So this is the default UI. Once um, for for the guest users, uh, the uh, the pages are are hidden here on the on the left sidebar. Let's uh, authenticate using the super user account just uh, to visualize all the all the options we have here the the groups and the users we can see here that um, the the default um, admin section for django is styled with this uh, with this design which uh, looks super super nice in my opinion we have also um, a dark mode which is persistent okay let's um, let's sign out for now and uh, go back to the to the main dashboard I will uh, create an ordinary user account I will type here the password just to avoid uh, typing uh, the wrong password once the user is um, it uh, is created. We are redirected to the sign-in page, and we can access all the all the private pages provided by the by this design. We can see here 
on the left that uh, on the sidebar that uh, all the pages are are accessible we can uh, can visualize the the charts form elements and other other things profile page and uh, of course we can uh, sign out or change the password and all other other options so um, the product uh, comes with uh, some new features if we go here to the, to the readme starting from this version the, the product is no longer uh, the design is no longer hard coded inside the product and uh, uh, comes uh, from an external library which is also open source so basically junk admin data is the library that styles all the pages and this means that uh, anyone can can install the the library and use this design in any Django um, uh, project, uh, new or legacy. And the design is applied to to your entire project um, and styles also the super user part. And uh, of course, the the common pages are also available. If we go back here to the uh, to the um, to the sign in and use uh, again the super user account we should see the the new the new user register here on the on the um, users uh, user tab so guys thanks for watching let us know what you think about the project in case anyone have issues uh, feel free to access here the score page um, we have uh, here the the coordinates that uh, anyone can use the the, email, the official email and also the the link to the discord um, server where we provide um, live assistance thanks again for watching adrian here from mapsid and uh, in all cases let us uh, let us know what you think about the project and uh, how we we can improve this uh, this starter wish you all a super super day and uh, for sure we will uh, see you again on another material bye guys